one thing everybody wished about chat gpt is if chat gpt can have access to internet it would be amazing because for example i asked who won the fifa 2022 world cup and chat gpt said fifa world cup has not taken place which is not true because chat gpt does not have this information and that is exactly why it said that but today you have a plugin chrome extension precisely or a browser extension that can augment chat gpt results along with the internet information for example after switching on this i asked chat gpt again who won the fifa 2022 world cup chat gpt got all this information and that information is used to summarize and give the result so now it says according to the new information using the plugin it says was won by argentina and then that is exactly how you can augment internet web information with chat gpt so in this tutorial i am going to show you how to do this for your own browser first let me go and uninstall this so that i don't have this and we'll start from scratch this is a wonderful project by kunash this is called chat gpt advanced also called as web chat gpt this is a chromium extension which means you can install it in chrome you can install it in brave browser so it's a chromium extension that adds web access capability to chat gpt basically it gets information separately from web and then augments it to chat gpt and then chat gpt uses that information to summarize and give you the result to the question that you asked this is how it works it doesn't expose chat gpt to completely to internet but this is a nice hack so if you want to install this you have two ways to install it you can do a manual installation so you can download the code unzip it and add it to the chrome extension so this is um, this is the developer way of doing you need to have developer mode enabled and then you can do this thing if you do not want to do this you can uh, directly go click this link and go to the chrome extension and install it there is a way for you to install this on firefox as well try it out if you have difficulties i might you know help you with the installation separately so first click this once you click that it will take you to the chrome extension page where you see web chat gpt and then you can see some information about it all you have to do is add to brave in my case i've got a brave browser if you have got a chrome you can say add to chrome or microsoft edge whatever browser that you have got so once it is added to brave now close your existing chat gpt tab and then go again and then open a new chat gpt tab so chat.openai.com once you open a new chat gpt tab you would start seeing this new things for example with web chat gpt you can augment your prompts with the relevant web results for better and up to date answer you would see a toggle button here that is to enable or disable search on the web so first i'm going to disable it and then i'm going to ask a question and then that you i'm going to enable it and i'm going to um, see the result for example let me disable it first and I, i'm going to say who won the india versus sri lanka cricket match that happened on jan 3rd 2023 so this literally happened yesterday a cricket match and uh, let's see what chat gpt says it says i'm sorry i don't have the information about cricket matches that took place after the knowledge cut off date so after 2021 okay cool so now what we can do is now we can go ahead toggle this and then say search on the web and i can copy this question and paste the same question again and then i can send this question i'm not sure if it is going to work but this is an experiment so i'm trying to ask what is the result so it says it appears that india won the match of course india won the match that happened on jan 3rd and this is according to the sources the good thing here is it is not just giving you the result but it also gives you the sources now i can copy this source open it in a new tab and then see what happened there so these inf it doesn't look like this information appeared from nowhere but also you get the references very wikipedia style references that chat gpt ideally doesn't give you but this extension helps you with that if you want to customize this extension you can also go here the web web chat gpt options you can see that button here how many results you want and also you can see how like when do you want the results from you you want it from the last one year last one month last week last day and also the region for example if you want a region specific information then you can get that information as well for example i'm going to ask a question what are the best biryani places in bangalore 2023 so i'm going to ask this information now it's going to make a search for me and based on the search it has found out that on, after jan 2023 somebody has posted this article and based on this 
this is giving this information to me so now this is how updated this is so basically whatever you search goes to the internet get searched that content is given to chat gpt and then chat gpt kind of summarizes that for you and then gives you the result this is mind blowing the way you can connect chat gpt and internet like there are rumors that microsoft might include chat gpt in bing but you don't want my you don't need microsoft to include it you can literally do the best way today by installing this amazing application from kunash so you can install this web chat gpt chrome extension or firefox if you have got microsoft edge brave whatever it is and you can augment chat gpt with the web so you are powering chat gpt's knowledge but you are not just simply powering that knowledge from the large language model itself but you are taking knowledge from the internet giving it to chat gpt and you are powering it in fact like this this result is good because i just ate this biryani today magnus foods so this is how chat gpt is good and you can augment chat gpt result with internet uh, internet content uh, shout out to the developer kunash so if you have uh, if you have reached here make sure you start the repository and also you know support the developer if you if you like the con like the project that they have put together but otherwise if you found anything interesting like this please let me know in the comment section otherwise i hope this video was helpful to you in connecting chat gpt with internet and this is quite powerful i must tell you i hope you enjoyed this see you in the next video happy prompting